Hello, this is Dr. Jeff Tarrant, director of the Neuro Meditation Institute. And I wanted to take just a couple of minutes to describe the quiet mind style of meditation. Now, this is the stereotype of meditation. This is what people think of when they think of meditation, that somehow miraculously you sit down and nothing is happening. Your mind is empty. It's just blackness. Now, some people can do this, and certainly there are certain styles of meditation, like Zen or Transcendental Meditation, that this is where you are learning to shift your consciousness. For most people, uh, this feels like an impossibility. The idea that the mind can be quiet at all. You can learn to navigate into these states if you know certain uh, tricks or tools. One of the things that is really interesting about this particular style is that when you learn to move into these quiet spaces, what it actually does is inhibits networks in the brain. There's one network in particular called the default mode network. And this is a set of regions that work together that essentially have to do with you thinking about yourself. So if you're planning for the future, if you're in a memory, if you're worried about something, if you're making a grocery list in your head, whatever, all of those things relate back to you. It's you thinking about yourself or something in relation to yourself. And when you're in a quiet mind state, all of those regions that are doing that are inhibited, which is why it's quiet. So this can be a very powerful practice, particularly for dealing with things like anxiety or depression, obsessive compulsive disorder, eating disorders, actually just about any mental health concern. This can be really important because you are inhibiting the normal ways that you think about yourself. So if those normal ways you think about yourself cause problems, this is a great practice to shut that down for a few moments and allow for a new possibility, allow for a new way to think about yourself or your situation. So this can be a very powerful practice for a whole range of things. I hope you'll check out some of the resources we have available and maybe join us for a class. Thanks so much. Hope to see you soon.